Republicans in the U.S. Senate have derailed a bipartisan inquiry into a deadly assault on the Capitol by former President Donald Trump's supporters. Despite a torrent of criticism, they were playing down the violence. Democrats and some moderate Republicans had called for a commission to probe the events leading up to and January 6, when hundreds of supporters of Trump and Republicans stormed the Capitol fighting with police. The violence left five people dead, including a Capitol police officer. The measure failed by a vote of 54 to 35, short of the 60 votes needed to advance the legislation in the 100-member Senate. The 35 number of votes were all Republicans. Unanimous consent, the mandatory quorum call has been waived. The question is, is it the sense of the Senate that debate on the motion to proceed to H.R. 3233, an act to establish the National Commission to investigate the January 6th attack on the United States Capitol complex and for other purposes shall be brought to a close. The yeas and nays are mandatory under the rule. The clerk will call the roll. On this vote, the yeas are 54, the nays are 35, three-fifths of the senators duly cho chosen and sworn not having voted in the affirmative. The motion is not agreed to. The Republican minority just mounted a partisan filibuster against an independent commission to report on January 6th. Both, both efforts should have moved forward in a solidly bipartisan way. But out of fear or fealty to Donald Trump, the Republican minority just prevented the American people from getting the full truth about January 6th. The Republican minority just prevented the Senate from even debating the bill. No opportunity for amendments, no opportunity for debate. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.